Did you know that gene testing services that guide you through conditions such as Down syndrome is available in Sri Lanka? Genetic testing for conditions such as Down syndrome has now been made easier for countries like Sri Lanka with organizations like Gene Labs Medical. Down syndrome is a mutation that occurs in babies' genes during the early stages of pregnancy. Children born with Down syndrome have distinct physical and mental characteristics that may hinder their development. There is no doubt that every child is special, despite their health conditions. However, given that Down syndrome poses a threat to the precious lives of the child, and it is a lifelong condition, it is important that parents are aware of the genetic conditions their unborn child may have so that they can make informed decisions for the child's future. This is where Gene Labs Medical steps in. We carry out genetic tests for many different conditions, diseases, including cancer. Much like many other Asian countries, Sri Lanka's testing methods for such conditions are outdated and involve the risk of miscarriage for the unborn child. Now, a safe and complete analysis can be conducted by using just a sample of the mother's blood with the results being 99% accurate. The process is called NIPT and can be conducted as early as the 10th week of pregnancy. We are to date the only lab that carries out this test in Sri Lanka. Gene Labs Medical were the first to introduce this testing method to Sri Lanka and have now completed testing for over 1,000 mothers. We also have another test uh, a genetic test, which is specially geared towards couples having difficulty in getting pregnant and then go through uh, the procedure of in vitro fertilization, called, also called IVF. How our tests help in this situation is, usually during IVF procedures, embryos that are healthy are selected by the embryologists to be implanted back in the womb. And with the test that we have called pre-implantation genetic screening, we can identify embryos that may result in a baby with the Down syndrome. So ultimately, you can identify really healthy ones and help in exclusion of uh, bad embryos that can give rise to a Down baby. Right from infancy, children with Down syndrome require support, from speech to physical therapy and even brain-stimulating activities. The extra help they receive during this time is to make sure that their physical and intellectual abilities do not hinder them from reaching their fullest potential. Moreover, for anyone looking for assistance in the upbringing of a child with any genetic condition, centres such as the Genendi Resource Centre, with their supportive and caring environment, are easily available to you. As we commemorate World Down Syndrome Day, let's create more awareness on the challenges which individuals with Down syndrome face on a daily basis and also create awareness on the different resources which are available to them as well as their loving families.